The more I use glass, the more it speaks about this fragility of life, how robust it is, yet how fragile it is. I'm Catherine Dowson and I'm a sculptor. I'm fascinated by medicine and anatomy and the world inside. So it's the hidden side of life that I'm really interested in. The things that exist that you can't see. All around the world, there are these laboratories and scientists all working on different bits of the puzzle of HIV AIDS. So I got this single trimer. Now a trimer is the mushroom shape that's attached to the envelope of the virus. There's a weakness where the trimer and the envelope meet. And they think at that weakness, they might be able to then develop a drug that can go in at that point to the center and then kill the virus. And so I have eight blocks that when you put together, make up the trimer and each block has a little piece of the puzzle of the trimer inside. So they're all separate, but they're all connected. So each separate part represents a different laboratory around the world and different scientists all over the world working on the actual problem of HIV. Art of Saving a Life is all about hope for the future. If it creates a discussion around HIV, if it creates a discussion about all these other vaccines, then more people can understand what's going on and more people can see how important it is for the research to continue.